Uh, Mr. Binning is... Ah, uh, moved here. Right. Excuse me. Hi. Hi, Pete. Hey. So, just wanted to let you know, Cassie's awake. Oh, thanks. She's asking for you both. Apparently, I wasn't actually in with her. Do you want me to come with you? Oh, I can't. Right now, I'm in the middle of rounds. Cassie will have to wait. OK. I also just wanted to say how sorry I am for your loss. I know you're both hoping to be different. Sadly, our hopes were buried in a shallow grave. Grave. Sorry, ignore me. Thanks, Pete. You OK? Sorry. It's a stupid question. I'm taking it out on everyone. You're grieving. You know, it's nearly a year since Wilder died. I know. And now this? It's all just so damn unfair and bleak. Maybe you need to go home. No, no, I'm fine. <clears throat> need to work. OK. I'm all right. Well, maybe we could go and see Cassie together. Um, you go. I'll see you later, maybe. So? Cassie's being transferred from HDU, so see you in Ward 6. Yeah, I'll be there soon. Her pain needs need to be reviewed. She's really feeling it. I said I'll be there. Um, how come you're looking after Cassie? Didn't Drew do her op? Maybe he's had a guts fall. What do you mean? Well, he's probably feeling weird after saving her in surgery. Maybe he can't face doing the post-op care. Why not? Why do you think she killed her baby and buried it? Well we don't know that, and even if she did, Cassie still deserves the same professional care as everyone else. Okay, well, tell that to Drew, not me. Billy, can... Hey, what brings you up here? I just thought I'd check how Cassie's doing. Um, she's out of HDU, and we've just settled her into a ward. Oh, it's good. She's making progress. Mm, she will be here for about a week, at least. A whole week? Jesus. Yeah, yeah. doctor's orders. Well, it'll fly by and she'll be home before you know it. No? Uh, Cassie won't be bailed to our address. Why? What's happened? What's happened? A baby is dead. Dead and buried. Maeve. We we've spoken to the police and social services. While Cassie awaits trial, she'll be remanded. They're going to lock her up? For what she did? Yeah. You, you don't know that she did it. Hey, I am way past giving her the benefit of the doubt. You'd be wise to do the same. Maeve. What? Ma if Cassie did hurt her Not hurt, Harper. Kill. Kill and bury. Well, it's because she's been really unwell. Yeah. I've heard that excuse before. It's not an excuse. I've been unwell too, just like Cassie. And Harper pulled through? Yeah, because of the people around me who love me. Do you really think that Cassie will cope in prison? She's just a kid herself. I'm sorry, I can't do this right now. Please don't tell me you agree with this, just throwing Cassie to the wolves like that? No, I don't, but Maeve is really struggling and I need to put her first. Lunching alone. Hey. Turn to me. Papa. Hey. How are you doing? Um, I don't really know. You have any pain? No, I don't think so. Are you my doctor now? No, no, I'm just um, checking in on you, just as a friend. Have you seen Maeve? Today, yeah. Yeah, she's, she's pretty busy. I'm in the hospitals at capacity again. She doesn't want to see me, does she? Like I said, she's busy. Nicole said that too. And I don't believe her like Maeve doesn't believe me. Maeve's had a big shock. She's grieving. She thinks I killed my baby, Wilder's baby. Look, she just needs a bit more time. It's been a year since Wilder died. A year already. Maeve blames me for that too. No, she doesn't, Cassie. I brought him into the church and the church killed him. And now Knox is dead too, so no wonder she hates me. She doesn't hate you. She's just... Struggling? Yes. Nicole said that too. Well, she is a wise woman, that Nicole. She was scared I'd hurt Billy. Mothers are protective. No, some mothers are monsters. You still haven't asked me yet, isn't that why you're here? No, I'm just, um, I'm making sure you're okay. No, you want to know. Go on, ask me, did I kill my baby? I don't need to do that. Ask me. Did you? I don't know. I can't remember anything. I don't know anything anymore.